So the second most largest CSGO transaction ever just happened. This skin sold for more than $400,000 and the NFT owners are mad that people are willing to spend that much for a CSGO skin and not a Bored Ape NFT. This is about the fifth big tweet I've seen of a Bored Ape influencer getting ticked off because CSGO skins are selling for so much. The very concept of in-game cosmetics costing as much as real life currency is obstructing the thought process behind every NFT influencer for the last few days. Because if you've been living under a rock, CSGO is back. With the announcement of the second game coming out this summer around June or July, the Steam Marketplace is up more than ever before. Cases that used to cost less than 10 cents are worth 10 times more now and rising every day due to the heavy traffic the game is getting right now. OG players and new players are coming to CSGO and everyone wants to open cases for a chance to get these rare expensive skins. Everyone has just been awakened like their third eye open and everyone's starting to realize just how valuable the in-game cosmetics are in Counter-Strike. And the second game isn't even out out yet well the beta is if you can even get access to that but just the announcement alone made the value of everything just double so imagine how much everything is going to grow once cs2 drops in just a few months and that's why everyone's talking about csgo now and the steam market and it's crazy how some of these skins are actually worth that case hardens ak-47 is extremely rare and if it's the blue gem variant it goes for 400k and more i heard someone even offered a guy 3 million for it and this whole craze around csgo skins is just getting nft owners mad Anytime a big transaction goes down or a new big skin starts trending, everyone starts to talk about how these NFT boys get heated because a lot of the new attention is going to CSGO skins instead of these bored ape yacht club NFTs. And a lot of them don't understand how the Steam market works because if they did, I'm pretty sure they will sell their NFTs immediately to buy some CSGO skins. It just drives them crazy how video game skins can cost as much as real life money and be worth something compared to other tactical shooters, even shooters in general or every game like Fortnite, Valorant, who try to sell some expensive skins at the same price as CSGO, but in the end aren't even valuable or come close to the same amount of value as CSGO. You buy a knife for 100 bucks on CS and that value can double or even triple within a month or it can drop, it's an active market. But if you change your mind, you can sell that knife, get your money back or spend it on another skin or even a game. And that's the advantage CSGO has over everything else. You can't do that with other games. But I don't get why people think this just started. This has been a thing for decades. But because the internet is social spaces have grown so much topics can grow far larger than ever before and that's why people get ticked off by a five second tiktok or a simple tweet talking about how a ak-47 skin on a pc shooter sold for more than 400k becoming the second largest transaction in csgo history ever and confusing the hell out of everyone online because back then it used to happen a lot but it rarely been known but over the last few months ever since counter-strike has been getting a lot of attention everyone is hungry for the rare csgo skins known to man now and they're willing to buy it off people with expensive inventories or they just open cases making the value of everything explode it's just insane how much everything is going up especially when the new game drops and the fact that non-csgo players or worse nft owners can't understand how the steam marketplace works and how the cosmetics in csgo are back behind the steam community market that's why the value goes up and down it's just shocking to me and these bored abe owners are losing their minds getting pissed off because nobody's buying their nfts anymore people are actually more into csgo skins now and it wouldn't surprise me if the steam marketplace becomes bigger than nfts or even ethereum imagine but this is just the start of the nft versus cs player biz guys it's gonna go on more frequently now because these ethereum elephants these bored ape monkeys hate the fact that csgo skins are becoming more and more valuable literally all i see now online anytime i try to get some sort of csgo 2 news it's either someone talking about the new big skin blowing up how much it's worth how much it's sold for and then an nft boy is mad it's still crazy to me how much more interested people are into investing investing on CSGO than a picture about a rich ape. 2023 is a very interesting year. And yeah, I just wanted to talk on this. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new. And let me know your thoughts on NFT owners getting mad at CSGO skins and how much they're growing. I really wonder how Valve is going to handle all the market changes and the complete shift in the community when it comes to CS cases and opening them. Because I'm not going to lie, I've been playing CSGO for almost six years. I never opened cases until now. So that kind of shows for something. But yeah, I'm going to stop talking. I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out. Stay blue.